Bestie Inventor is sick. Hey, best friends. So today was a great day at work. This was my first week um, in my new position um, at my job. I am still at a social work facility, but I have got promoted to doing a more in-house position. Um, so it was great. We had a promotion party today um, that a lot of the people at the job threw for me and a couple other co-workers. It was great. However, around about 11.30ish today, the party started at like 12.30, I started feeling sick. And I know how my body is when it starts feeling sick. I start getting aches. That's the first sign. My body starts aching because typically my body don't do that. And usually it starts right in the back here of my neck. If y'all know what I'm talking about when you turn, it's like, ouch, ouch. And then soon it starts progressing and it's like all over even your eyeballs when you turn it this way or that way like up here it just starts aching so to me that's a sign of getting like the flu or something that always happens to me at least once a year it's kind of early as october um, i could tell that i am coming down with a fever it might be a low grade fever because i have chills all over my body like my skin the bumps are raised in my body because I'm cold. Right now, I feel warm because I have this hot tea in my hand. This is actually, let me see if I can show y'all. You see that? Yeah, so that's um, the Theraflu. I had one package left, so I came straight home. Kids was at their um, grandma's house. I texted her and told her I'm not feeling good and to just give me some time to get them. I want to drink this tea, let it start working, relieve the pain. And then I go pick up the kids, so at least I'll feel up to, you know, supervising, you know, the children properly, hopefully. Uh, because the Theraflu is supposed to have, like, Tylenol in it to help you with body aches. Um, it's like severe cold. Um, it don't say it's cold and flu, just a severe cold. I don't have a cold right now, but I know I'm starting to come down with something. I'm not sure if it's going to get worse or if it's just going to clear up. I'm hoping it just clears up. I'm kind of used to feeling like this when I get sick. It's just a bad feeling. Um, and typically, typically, I feel like this when I start getting a cold or when I have a cold already. So this is kind of strange. I'm trying to drink it while it's still hot, hot. Um, I added some ginger crystals in it, which you can actually have just as a tea it comes inside of the, um, the Chinese market. Um, I do have ginger root. I felt so cold and so sick that, um, I didn't feel like, like cutting up any ginger root and putting it in there and blending or making or anything. I was like, listen, I have these ginger crystals. They're just as strong. They're just as good. Put that in there. Ginger is a good, from what I was told, is a good, like, anti-biotic, I guess, or not even biotic, like a anti-something, bacterial, whatever it is. Um, I know I really should have my facts straight, but my mind's not there. I'm not feeling great. Whatever it is, I know it's good for you, especially when you don't feel well. Even when you do feel well, it's supposed to be good for helping you maintain a good um, immunity, immune system. So um, I put the ginger crystals in here to help try to, you know, clear out whatever is trying to take over my body. So the reason why I'm doing this video is because I expressed to all my best friends that you guys will get the raw and uncut versions of me. The good, the bad, the ugly, and the great, and the beautiful, and the lovely um, versions of me. So I wanted to, um, exp you know, share this um, with you guys. So I'll keep you guys updated. It's probably going to be a long video because I'm just going to add in my days up until the time that I feel better, God willing. Um, so pray for me, guys. Um, even though I know this video is going to be posted afterwards, but um, I'll keep myself in prayer. And I know I have others praying for me that I will feel better um, and that this is nothing major. That is something minor that will go away within, you know, a few hours or the next day or two or soon. Point blank period soon. All right, best friends. Um, I'll keep you updated on my journey. Uh, feeling better. I'm going to drink this ginger crystal Theraflu hot tea. And I'm going to keep my distance as much as I can away from my children. Um, the baby's going to be difficult because he always like fuss and cry for me. But I'm going to, what I'm going to do is 
Um, I have a blanket right here on the bed that I'm just going to kind of use just for myself. It's kind of fleece material. I'm going to wrap myself up in it for the next half hour. And then hopefully everything will just calm down. And what if I'm getting a fever that will just break and then I'll be able to throw a lot of clothes on and go out and get the kids. It's not even that cold outside. I mean, it's, it's a little brisk, but it's not that cold. Um, I think the high was like 69 today, which is almost 70. So it's not bad. Um, this morning it was cold. It was 50 something degrees, 54 degrees or something, um, which was chilly. Um, and I went out with a long sleeve, um, almost sweater type, um, material. So maybe I'm not wearing enough clothes outside with the weather changing. So with that being said, I'll keep you guys updated. Talk to you later, best friends. Bye y'all. Day number two. Hey, best friends. Day two. I'm not feeling too great. Last night was terrible. I slept a total of two hours. Chills, teeth chattering, body shaking. Couldn't get myself warm to save my life. Put on a big hoodie, which I have on now. A fleece blanket, which I have on now. And a sheet, which I have on now. And I still wasn't warm. I couldn't do anything to get warm. So, around 4 a.m., enough was enough. My body was in too much pain. I was too cold. So, I woke my husband up and asked him, could he give me some Tylenol? He did. So, today I'm supposed to take my baby boy to the hematology appointment. So, my husband had to go into work late to take him because I just can't do it. I did get up, brush my teeth, took a shower, which was still a lot. But I have to be clean. I can't just lay in bed crazy all day. Um, I just took another Tylenol because I started getting cold again. I'm still feeling chilly. My husband gave me some tea this morning and set some Tylenol to the side, which I just took. I drank all the tea. My aunt's on the way with some Theraflu. Um, that's it. Pretty much going to be in the bed all day until I can feel better. I'm going to rest my body. Drink as much flus as possible without throwing it up because I did feel like throwing up not too long ago, but I didn't. So I don't know what's going on, but I'm hoping that will be resolved in the next few hours to a day. I don't want my Saturday tomorrow to be a waste. I want to be able to engage with my children. And Sunday I got to work. So this definitely has to resolve itself. <laughs> All right, guys. Checking out. Bye, y'all. Day three. Hey, my best friends. So, yes, this is day three of not feeling too great. Um, so, this is just an update. About 65 to 70% um, back to myself. As you can see, I'm out and about. Had to force myself to get up and get out. That's one of my husband's biggest pet peeves about when people are sick that they just don't get up and force themselves to try to become their best selves so we can get it best selves best friends anyway um sometimes you just can't do it and that's how i was yesterday i was just in the bed all day yesterday i didn't want to eat nothing drinking water tylenol whatnot whatever today i was in the bed most of the day right now it's like 3 30 i just got up about maybe an hour ago got in the shower just dropped little man, little Chucky, <laughs> to my aunt's house. So she go watch around, run some errands. As you can see, I'm not completely myself. My hair looks, you know, a mess. Um, my eyes still look a little tired or whatnot. Um, but guess what? I told you y'all was going to see the raw and uncut bestie inventor. My my day in, day out. Me being normal. <laughs> um, here she is. So hopefully by tomorrow, I'll be 100%. I still have on and off chills. Right now, I'm hot and sweaty. Um, the temperature outside is 72, so I really shouldn't be, like, hot and sweaty. But I am. Um, it's better than being cold. 
and having, you know, the chills and your teeth chattering. That was me yesterday and that was me Thursday night. So I had to get my days right today, Saturday. So day three, that's what it is. I have to run to the store, get some things for my daughter and for a client of mine's. Um, and then I'm going to go home, check on the household, see what I can help out with, what I can get done real quick. I'm planning on getting the baby between 5 and 5.30 for my aunt because she works tonight. Um, so that's it. I just want to watch him for a couple hours while I run my errands. Right now, I'm sitting in the parking lot of the bank. Got to get some coins out um, so that I can go shopping. And that's it. My best friends. So I'll keep you guys posted. Bye, y'all. All right, just finished shopping. Picked up baby boy. The hell, y'all. <laughs> hey, y'all. Hi, Bash. Oh, yarning. Oh, sweetness. Oh. Ah, mama. Baba. Daddy. Mommy. Mama. No, mama. <laughs> so cute. So, I'm going to show y'all the bags from shopping. On the floor. I know I look in so much better condition. <coughs> Excuse me. Earlier, so I was about 65 to 70 percent. Now I'm about 80 percent. I don't know if going out and getting fresh air <coughs> actually helped me, but I feel a lot better. Just gotta get my look together. But <coughs> it's almost six o'clock at night. I'm not gonna be looking any better tonight. What I'm going to do though is go home. <laughs> what am I going to do? Let's go home. Uh, I have myself some wine, drink some wine, and um, check up on my children and have some mommy children time because I work tomorrow. And I kind of feel a little guilty that I was sick most of the day today. Hey, cut out. I was sick most of the day today and couldn't really give them my undivided attention. So I'm going to go home and spend a couple hours with playing with them. Um, but yes, best the inventor is <laughs> bye y'all thank you guys for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe and press that notification bell if you haven't done so already thanks for watching best the inventor bye y'all